Okay, I'm uh, going to give you some instructions on firing this boiler up. It's been running now for about 45 minutes. It's up to 100 pounds. Pop-off valve might go off. Uh, now this one's set up 125, so it's got a ways to go anyway. Um, first thing I do is I'm just using some scrap wood today. Normally I use cordwood, like fir, something like that, or maple. And um, ouch, thing's hot. Uh, I bank on the left and right side with big pieces of wood just to kind of give us some air ventilation, just like you'd make a campfire. And uh, then I put my paper and kindling in the center. The door is really hot. Uh, then, uh, let's see. So that's just starting the fire. And like I said, it's only been going for about 45 minutes now. And it's just normal tap water. Uh, Whatever you've got will work in these boilers just fine. Um, the pump, um, got it going here real good. This is an air bleeder valve. So if there's air in the pump, then you want to open that up. Sometimes you even have to take the hose out and put water down the hose. You know, just fill this hose up with water and pump it a few times. As soon as the pump gets water into it, though, the check valve here will keep it from coming out. But you've got to get it into the pump, kind of forcing it sometimes. Uh, water sight glass is right here. I always keep it about halfway. Uh, and I just plug the water in here. That's the very first thing you want to do as well, is uh, put water in the boiler. Never, ever fire a boiler uh, dry and then put water in it because it will it could have a catastrophe. So, um, the tricocks are here. Um, I don't use them much, but you can see the sight glass. See, if you had a sight glass that was broken, you'd use your uh, tricocks to know where the water level is, but that's not going to happen. And uh, ash pan is down here. Something here to protect my fingers. Should have a glove out here. Ash pan right here. Is, I keep it open about an inch. Um, the engine I haven't run yet, but I will in another video. And uh, that's about it. Pretty simple. And then as far as the pump goes, just pumping it. I open this up, the air. air. That's a little bit of steam coming out of there, but that's all right. When you got solid water coming out of that little valve, you can just close it up, and now everything's going into the boiler. That's about it. And uh, this is the blower valve. Probably hear it. It uses steam. Uh, like if you've got it going with steam, uh, the steam pressure, then you just open that up a little bit when you put new wood in it, just for a minute or so, and then just to start the new wood burning. And it really blows a lot of uh, air, draws in air, because that goes up the stack, it draws in air underneath the fire and uh, gets the fire going real hot and fast. That's about it.